we're gonna take a look at Google Tasks. Google Tasks is your digital to-do list and you can also access it if you have a tablet or mobile device as well. So if you are a sixth through 12th grader in the Winsville School District, you have access to Gmail. So let's go ahead and navigate to our Gmail because that is where you can find Google Tasks built right into your email. So let's go to mail.google.com. And on the right-hand side, there's a built-in toolbar. You're gonna see your Google Calendar link there, Google Keep. And the last little icon there, that blue circle, is our task list. So let's go ahead and click it and open it up. So at the very top, if I simply wanna add an item to my to-do list, I click Add a Tasks. And then I can type right in there what I need to do. And then once I've typed it in, any item that I have on my to-do list, over on the right-hand side, there's also a pencil icon that lets me edit it. So if I need to change the task itself, add in details, if I wanna add in small, smaller tasks under it, I could also do that here. I'm gonna hit my back arrow now. Once I complete a task, I just give it the check mark. It then moves down to the very bottom of my list. So in just a second here, when this completed uh, notice goes away, right under that, I can expand out. From here, I can delete tasks that I'm sure I've completed. If I'm not sure I completed it or need to uncheck it, I just press that check mark again and it moves back up to the top of my list. I also have the option here where it says my tasks to drop down and create additional lists. So if you want a list for every class that you have, or if you want to separate them out in a way, you can do that right here. As just a side note, Google Tasks is also available on Android and iOS devices. So I can go on my phone and click the little task icon, log in with my at WSDR4.org account, and have all my lists sync right here on my phone as well. So that is Google Tasks.